Hi, I'm Katie Gutugno, and I am so excited to talk to you about my new book, Fireworks, which is set in the 90s. You might not know this about me, but I am a huge 90s girl. And today I am so excited to chat with you about some of my favorite things from my favorite decade. I knew I wanted to set my book in Orlando uh, in 1997 because that was the epicenter of the boy and girl band pop craze. So obviously that was a place that I felt super connected to, being as obsessed with boy and girl bands as I am. I have seen the band Hanson in concert 31 times. Um, I know that you all wish that you could be as cool as me. I was a Taylor, obviously. Taylor being the best one. So if all of the trends from the 90s are coming back, I would like to vote for the Walkman. So then, of course, the official candy of the 90s would be the Chupa Choop. <laughs> we used to fight over these to get the Spice Girls stickers inside. I don't actually know if they even make these. These might be from the 90s. <laughs> So one of my favorite things about the 90s was all of the amazing fashion. Your butterfly clips, your plastic chokers, uh, and of course your snap bracelets. It's cool guys, I know I look good. The 90s also had some really amazing fads, such as Beanie Babies. I remember that we weren't allowed to even touch the tags on some of these because we had to keep them in pristine condition so that one day they'd be worth enough money to send you to college. You didn't send me to college. <laughs> One of the weirdest trends of the 90s was probably pogs. For those of you youngins out there, they were little circular discs that you traded and... Well, I don't even know what else you did with them. What else did you do with them? 